Hi there. Are you finding yourself at home educating your child during this unprecedented time? Have you told yourself that uh, that this is the opportunity that you've been waiting for to really help your child succeed with reading comprehension? Well, if you have and you are looking for some creative, great ideas to help your child, stay tuned because we're going to show you a great idea to assist you during this unprecedented time. Hi, I'm Ashley and I'm with Homeschool Navigator, a subsidiary of Navigator Learning Solutions, and we are here to help you. Today we are going to talk about interactive book studies. Let me show you some examples and how to get started with interactive book studies. So now is the time to start. You can use these book studies uh, as a perfect way to help your child engage with books and uh, take it to the next level. It's more than just writing. It takes reading comprehension to the next level. Let me show you an example here. Over here are some, just a few of our examples of book studies, but let me, let's dive into one. This story is because of Winn-Dixie. It's about a fourth grade reading level, um, and it works like this. Here's the page that looks like this. Let me show you a more detailed page. It begins by showing you how to get started, and then it has your child read or listen to the first few chapters. Here's the directions here. And then from there, um, they answer some of the questions, and then they begin, begin getting creative and cutting out the questions and answers to glue into a notebook. The questions are on top, and the answers are hidden below the flap, like a flat book. So for example, um, in the story Because of Winn-Dixie by Kate DiCamillo, we have this. The book study talks about different things. For example, it says a simile is a comparison that is made between two things that uses the word like or as. And then it gives an example. And then down here, they encourage your child to go through the book and find a simile in those first few chapters that they've read. Then they would cut this out, glue it onto another page, and write the answer underneath. That's how you get the flat made. They would fold it on this dotted line here. Here's another question. They would cut this out, fold it on the dotted line, and then answer the question underneath the flap. Here is the how to get started page, and this shows it in action. It shows the steps on how to do it and what it should look like. So if they were asked to cut out a star, they would cut this out, they would fold on the dotted line, and then they would write the answer underneath here. Over here is a box. They would write the answer on these little flaps. They would fold them over and they would uncover the answer when they shared it with their friends and family. They can be so proud of these books. It's very exciting. Here's a few extra pages to show you. Here's that star that you would cut out. Um, it talks about comparing uh, characters or words, giving uh, describing the character and listing their character traits here. Um, this is really great. Sometimes when a student is reading and not comprehending, comprehending, they need to be slowed down and asked questions to build those layers of learning that need to happen. The interactive book study is a perfect way to help your child. It's easy. Here are a few of our bestsellers, but we have lots more. Um, grades two through six can easily do these books and they really do enjoy them. You just need a notebook or some pages stapled together. Um, an idea you could uh, staple colored pages together and then the, when you print it off on the white, it makes a nice contrast for your child. Um, right now, uh, we would normally be allowed to be able to get these books at the libraries or the bookstore, with, but with everything closed, um, your library does offer some uh, audiobooks. I checked our local library and they do have these available as an audiobook and an ebook. Um, Audible.com just launched a free uh, site to help kids uh, read. These books are on their audible.com site for free as well. So I encourage you to check that out. Um, so I want to encourage you to try a book study and see what you think. Let us know how it's going. If you have any questions, we have a chat tab on our website at homeschoolnavigator.com. Feel free to ask any questions. We are here to help you and keep the learning going in your home. 
Now is the time to start. Stay healthy.